Lawmakers on both sides of the aisle in Washington have started a push to keep funding for the Great Lakes flowing. Set to end in 2026, the Great Lakes Restoration Initiative helps address a range of issues impacting the Great Lakes from PFAS to Asian carp. Lakeshore Congressman Bill Heisinger co-chairs the House Great Lakes Task Force. He says the time is now to start the reauthorization effort. Heisinger says that one of the biggest challenges is educating other members of Congress about the importance of the Great Lakes. Frankly, it's just, you know, there's a lot of our colleagues from the middle part of the uh, country or from either coast that don't really understand what the Great Lakes is about and how important it is to both, uh, you know, our uh, ecology, but our economy as well. I mean, it, it is trillions of dollars of impact uh, that uh, that we have uh, with the trade that's on the lakes, the, the wages that are tied to uh, to the Great Lakes. Um, uh, it's really uh, significant, not just for us in the region, but for the entire country. Heisinger and other supporters hope to get an increase in the funds from the current $475 million a year to a half a billion annually.